Uh, hold the camera for one second. Okay. Okay. Seconds up, huh? Right. All right. My name is Rashid Makata. Now spell the first name. R A S H I D. Rashid. Rashid, we're here in New York City. You're out here homeless. Yes. You told me you're a construction worker for many years. Yes, I'm, I was a construction worker for 23 years and I fell from ground zero. In what 2005. Uh, well, 9-11 hit 9-11. I got to 9-11 at 9-28. And I was there four years in construction doing the cleanup with Local 79 as a Mason tender. Uh, today I have chronic heart failure and I am homeless in Bellevue Shelter. Uh, I go to Columbia University for computers and I'm trying to rebuild my life to get myself back on my feet. Now, um, when we first started talking, you said that uh, sometimes the food is better out here than in the shelters. Well, there's nothing like the home touch of, uh, well, the shelter food, we have, um, uh, we eat TV dinners three times a day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But here, out here, you know, the churches cook, you know, with a, a home, home touch. Right. Yeah. Now. You're a construction worker. Ground Zero hit your health, and then you lost your job and you lost your apartment. Yes. And I'm too young. For, I'm 58. I'm too young for uh, for um, until I get 62. Then I can get, you know, a pension. Wow. Now, what caught my my attention is uh, we've been out here for a while. And you're just so nice to people. I mean, just everybody that walk by and other homeless people and other non-homeless people. You're the kindest, kindest man I've seen out here today. Well, it has to do with my upbringing. I had a wonderful mother who was also so kind and giving to people. And those attributes of kindness go a long way. You know, charity starts at home, and I believe if you pick a man up, you can help him on his way. You pick him up today, he might be the one that might pick you up tomorrow. And it doesn't hurt to smile and give a kind word to someone that you know is suffering and in pain. You know, relieve someone's pain, help someone. Do something for someone that would be oh, meaningful. If you had three wishes, what would they be? Food, clothing, and shelter. Food, clothing, and shelter. That's it. Well, thank you very much for talking. You're welcome. Thank you for airing my story.